In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the image to video maker in Filmora 14 to make people kiss even when they're not kissing from a picture. Just a quick note, use this uh, not maliciously, but remember use it in scenarios where probably maybe it's a wedding and the only thing that's available is a photo and you want to make that couple kiss and add it to your workflow. So remember, don't use it for malicious purposes and I'll show you how it works. There are two ways to access it. You can either go to image to video. If I click on that, you'll see a couple of options or go back to the homepage. That is if you're on the startup window, uh, you can see in the toolbox, you can see image to video. Just click on that and it's going to bring you to this particular interface. Obviously selects that. Now, the image I'm going to use is a free image I got on pexels.com. So I want to test it out and see if it works as advertised. Now, if I come to the image uh, to uh, video uh, feature here, there are a bunch of options where you can create custom where you improve a prompt or have the AI kiss, hug your love, and then you can see AI fight, painting fugitive, a horror, uh, sandify, struck by lightning, smoke escape. They all have a couple of different uses. Now, of importance to us is the AI kiss. Just click on this. And from here, there are a couple of options that you can do. So you can see it right here. It's from images and then clearly it just transitions into a video. So you can either upload here, drag files here or customize to import a prompt. Now I'll just drag and drop a file right there. It's there, it's a single image, but you can also use stitch mode. And I'm assuming in this photo right here or the sample, they use stitch mode of two people, one on this side and the lady on this side. Uh, but this one is just a single image. So just single image. And by default, it uh, gives us the portrait uh, resolution. But if you're having a landscape video, you can do landscape as well. For example, just do a good uh, clear shot right about there and you want to incorporate it in your video. Maybe the couple did not get a video uh, for when they were doing a kiss uh, on their wedding and so on and so forth. So let's just go for portrait and then click on submit. And for this one, uh, because we just want it to be as it is, you can see that it's going to consume some good number of credits. So prioritize quality, generate high quality videos. Please wait. Let's just click on generate. Now what is going to happen and you can see here uh, there's a task list, image to video, it's uploading this particular image that we have here so that it can actually be now converted by AI uh, to give us the AI keys effect of uh, in a, uh, that is in uh, Filmora 14. So uh, let's just see uh, what we get from this particular uh, effect. Is it any good? Uh, obviously there are a couple of misuse cases I've seen around, but maybe with other AI tools, but mine is just to remind you that yes, use it for the right purposes. Maybe you are doing some videos for a client or you want to uh, maybe have some memories and maybe your photographer thought they were taking a video and they just took a picture and you want to convert that picture into a couple of you and your maybe girlfriend uh, 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 just having a good subtle kiss, then you can use it for that. So this is the AI case feature in the image to video uh, effect in Filmora. So it takes some time. Obviously it's now analyzing uh, everything that is the way they're standing, how it's going to pull it off. And I'd really love to see the result uh, of what uh, it gets. So quick question, would you use this effect? Maybe uh, if you're working on a video and did not get to do uh, maybe a video of uh, maybe during a wedding or maybe somebody was engaging to their girlfriend or something. This is something that you can use. Are you going to use it? Maybe to spice up your videos? Now, tell me in the comments. So let's just give it a couple of seconds. I'll speed up this section uh, and then we get uh, to see the result. So there we go. It's done. Uh, and we have our video right here. So I can actually just uh, play it and you can see it looks so natural, looks really good, but obviously you'll notice it looks like AI. It's five seconds at 16. So let's assume your couple did not have that particular image or video for their wedding or engagement. Then you can see right there. 
looks really good super super awesome uh, you may notice yes obviously towards the end right there it kind of looks fake but obviously this AI something else I've noticed uh, here she looks like she's more or less bareback as you move across kind of feels like she has some clothes on but the movement is kind of realistic and you may not even notice uh, all these things but it looks really really good if I actually play it from the start there we go image to video feature in Filmora 14 if you want to do an AI keys effect uh, maybe for a project that you're working on this is how you do it I hope this video is of value to you thank you so much for watching